Hi there. Welcome to ClearScope's text editor and optimized experience. This is where the magic of content optimization and building higher quality content in ClearScope happens. In this short video walkthrough, we'll demonstrate the basics of how to get up and running with ClearScope. Let's begin. Drafting in ClearScope is as simple as drafting in any other text editor or content management system you're familiar with. As you're drafting your piece of content, ClearScope will be real-time assessing how your content is scoring on these three metrics that you see on the left, a content grade, a word count, and a readability. We'll come back to how those work in just a second. First, you'll notice on the right, a list of terms surrounding this particular topic. What is content strategy? ClearScope has done advanced natural language processing on top ranking Google results to provide you with a list of recommendations. These recommendations are default sorted by importance, which is visually indicated by the dark gray line and numerically indicated should you click on any one of the terms. How ClearScope is able to say something like content marketing is pretty important, eight out of 10, is because we've detected a lot of top ranking results using content marketing within their pieces of content. The further down you scroll on the right, you'll notice that the dark gray line continues to decrease. That's because terms that are further down on the list are going to be less important. We see them used less frequently by top ranking results. The typical range of uses is based on how many of the competitors are using it at a minimal versus a maximal range. You should use these as simple guidelines and not strictly adhere to what we are recommending. To demonstrate then how content optimization works, I'm going to paste in a draft of a piece of content. You'll notice on the left, the metrics have improved significantly, and on the right, we have a lot of green check marks and some empty circles. The empty circle would indicate that we have not found types of content used within the piece of content. So now that we've used it, you see the green check mark. You can sort by unused to have a fairly quick assessment of the different ideas or concepts to consider adding to your piece of content to make it even better, even more comprehensive. To influence ClearScope's content grade, you'll notice that you are being evaluated on the usage of your unused terms. The more terms that you use that are unused, the better the overall grade will become. Word count is counting the number of words within your piece of content, and readability uses the Flesh Reading Ease test, a very common way that SEO tools measure readability. How we arrive at these suggested content grades and typical word counts is that we've taken a look at what the competitors are doing, and we're taking the median of the results. You should also use these, again, as simple guidelines and not hard and fast rules when you're building your content. 